Good day everyone, here's our math challenge for today. And here's our question. Given the equation x squared equals 69x plus y and y squared equals x plus 69y, wherein x is not equal to y, what is the value of square root of x squared plus y squared plus 1? Now, if you want to try this problem, just pause this video. We have 20 seconds and timer starts now. Time's up. Now let's answer this question together. Now our given is these two equation x squared equals 69x plus y and y squared equals x plus 69y. Now our goal is to get the value of square root of x squared plus y squared plus 1. Now to get the value of x squared plus y squared, what we're going to do is just add these two equation. Now if we do that, we get the value of x squared plus y squared must be equivalent to 70x plus 70y. Now, factor out 70, this will give us 70 multiplied by x plus y. Now, let's set aside this result. And what we need to do now is to get the value of x plus y to get the value of x squared plus y. And add one to it, then we're done. So the question is, how do we get the value of x plus y? Now, instead of adding this to equation, let's subtract this to equation. If we do that, we get x squared minus y squared equals 68x minus 68y. Now, 68 is common on the left-hand side, so let's factor out 68. This will give us 68 multiplied by x minus y. Now, take note that on the left-hand side, we have a square number minus another square number. Therefore, we can use the difference of two squares. So if we have a squared minus b squared, it is equivalent to a plus b multiplied by a minus b. Therefore, this x squared minus y on the left-hand side can be factored as x plus y multiplied by x minus y. Now take note that it is given that x is not equal to y. Therefore, x minus y is not a zero. So we can divide both sides by x minus y. So we can cancel out x minus y on the left hand side and on the right hand side. This will give us the value of x plus y must be 68. Now at this point, we have x squared plus y squared equals 70 times x plus y and we know the value of x plus y. This is just 68. Therefore, the value of x squared plus y squared must be 70 times 68 or simply 4760. Now, don't forget our goal. Our goal is to get the value of this expression, square root of x squared plus y squared plus 1. We know already the value of x squared plus y squared. This is equivalent to 4,760. Therefore, we have square root of 4,760 plus 1. Now, 4,760 plus 1 is just 4,761. And the square root of 4,761 is just 69. Therefore, if we have given these two equations, the value of square root of x squared plus y squared plus 1 is just 69. And as always, we are done.